What's up Bertini fam? So in today's video, as you can see, I received my carbon fiber bags from Hoffman Designs. Literally the leading in our industry for carbon fiber parts. They create the baddest and most beautiful parts. Bend over boy. They are the ones who did my front fender. They're the ones who did my carbon fiber dash and they're the ones who did my carbon fiber rear fender. Now going down the path of reducing weight on our bike and making it look as badass as possible, that's how we ended up with the carbon fiber bags. Now for those of y'all who don't know, Hoffman Designs literally makes the best carbon fiber parts in our industry. The quality is like, I mean, it's second to none. Nobody else even compares to the quality that they produce. And then also too, I don't know if you guys can see it in the video, but that gel coat that they put on their stuff, it is just gorgeous. I've had their parts on now for quite some time. As you see here, my rear fender, everything looks super mint. Everything is in great condition. It's still holding up. I know a lot of people worry about carbon fiber fading. And when you look at the parts and the process that Hoffman Designs has taken to produce these parts, it is just top notch. Now, I'm not sure if you guys are seeing in, this in the details, but this is real carbon fiber. This ain't Mickey Mouse stuff. They do a really, really good job on building their products. Everything, I mean, nothing is left undone. Everything is just super, super premium in whatever they do and put together. Now, enough with me trying to sell you on why you should be getting the best carbon fiber in the industry. Let's go ahead and roll the intro and jump into today's video. Now, very important, if you have not yet, click that subscribe button and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Do me a big favor and make sure you put some good energy out there into the world. Click that subscribe button. This way you can stay up to date with my entire build series on my 2020 Street Glide Special, as well as my Can-Am Outlander 1000R. And then of course, if you really wanna show me some more love, go ahead and click that like button on my video. And then of course, comment down below, letting me know what you guys think about the parts that I install in any of my videos including in today's video these carbon fiber bags now as you see here we got a scale this way we can weigh up these bags and compare them to our factory bags over here that are sitting now I will tell you these things are super light you can immediately feel it I don't know exactly how light we're gonna go ahead and check that here in a second by the way shout outs to fuel moto look at this yo this scully is legit I also like their logo they're good people's the people over at fuel moto they have amazing customer service. I know you hear me talk about them a lot in my videos. They are great, great people. Whenever you have a brand that gives you great customer service, you really got to appreciate them and show them a lot of love like they do to me. And I also want to give a special shout out to Hardworks for hooking me up with this saddlebag hardware kit. I preferred to get the one in black, or I opted, I should say, to get the one in black. This thing, this kit comes with everything you need for your new saddlebags. So the brackets, the latches, the keys, the cables, everything. Even the side mounting, uh, the I think it's latch cover is what it's called, but even this in black. You can get these in chrome, so if you have a chrome build, you of course can get these, but shout out to Hogwarts because this is what we're gonna be using on our new bags, and it's really nice to get all new hardware, locks, like I said, everything, latch covers, brackets. I mean, this kit literally has everything you need for your new bag. So if you are purchasing a set of new bags, I would highly recommend going with this kit from Hogwarts. It's a great kit. Um, we're gonna be installing this on today's build. And so, yeah, I'll be including links in the description box below where you can purchase all of the stuff in this video from. So make sure if you are interested, just go ahead and click that link. Or of course, you can call them up, let them know that Michael Bertini from YouTube sent you. And of course, they'll take care of you. One last thing before we get the bags weighed up, you are gonna have to use the supplied gaskets that Hoffman Designs is going to send with the carbon fiber bags and lids. So these are the gaskets that you're going to use if you are going with the carbon fiber bags and lids from Hoffman Designs. You are not gonna use the ones that are in the Hogwarts kit. Those are for factory bags. These are for the Hoffman Designs carbon fiber bags. All right, now what I'm gonna do here, just for the sake of science, is I'm gonna weigh up each of these parts individually. So those of you who are interested in just the bag, you know the weight that you're gonna be saving, or just, you know, if you're interested in just purchasing the lid, you'll also know the weight of that item. So I'll weigh both of them up separately, and then I'll weigh them up together so you can get an idea 
as to how much each part weighs. So the carbon fiber bags from Hoffman Designs weigh in at two pounds, 11 ounces. And the lid from Hoffman Designs, the carbon fiber lid weighs in at 14 ounces. So two pounds, 11 ounces and 14 ounces. Now the total carbon fiber bag setup from Hoffman Designs weighs in at a grand total of three pounds, nine ounces. So I believe that puts the grand total for the carbon fiber bags, both bags and lids from Hoffman Designs to a grand total weight of seven pounds, two ounces without any hardware on them. Now let's go ahead and get the new hardware on them. I'll also weigh one of the bags up so we can get a weight with the hardware included because obviously y'all are not gonna <laughs> install these without any hardware on them. We'll go ahead and get the hardware on them and then we'll get them weighed up to get an idea of what the running weight would actually be. All right, so we got one fully done and completed. Go ahead and open it up in here so you guys can see. Now, I did opt to keep the um, this strap here thing. I opted to keep the one that was on my old bags, which said uh, Harley Davidson Motorcycles versus the one that comes with the Hogwarts. One has the Hogwarts logo. No shots at Hogwarts, it's a nice logo, but I had the Harley Davidson one, so I might as well just keep it on there. Other than that, it came out really nice, came out looking really good, really happy with the end product of it. Let's go ahead and weigh up the Hoffman Designs carbon fiber bags, both the bag and the lid, and see how much that weighs. So with hardware and everything ready to go is six pounds, nine ounces. And now the running weight with all of the hardware on the factory bag, let's go ahead and get this weight up now to see what the running weight of the factory bag is with all of the hardware mounted on it. It actually populated an error for me. So I can't even do that, even though I wanted to do that. Um, it's, it's populating an error, that's how heavy it is. I'm gonna go ahead and grab the big boy scale to get these weighed up just so we can get an idea of what this setup actually weighs. You are an unstoppable good idea machine. <laughs> okay, so now that we got the big boy scale, let's go ahead and weigh the factory setup and see how much that weighs. So 12 pounds even is what the factory setup weighs, 12 pounds. Now let's see how much weight you're saving without any of the hardware on. So just the lid by itself is two pounds, nine ounces. And then the bag by itself is six pounds, 13 ounces. I'm telling you, it's heavy. Now let's go ahead and weigh both up together as a complete set. So we'll get the bag on there and we will get the lid on there as well. Okay, so the total setup is nine pounds, seven ounces as a raw, set up right so nothing on it no hardware no nothing just the bags by themselves all right so let's go ahead and go over all the data that we have we have the carbon fiber bags from hoffman designs versus the stock bags weight so the stock bags weight with hardware is 12 pounds while the hoffman designs carbon fiber bags are six pounds nine ounces both bags together meaning both stock bags equal out a weight of 24 pounds, which is extremely heavy. I didn't realize it was that much. And the Hoffman Designs carbon fiber bags combined weight, meaning for both bags with all hardware included, is 13 pounds, two ounces, which gives us a grand total weight savings of 11 pounds. Woo! First and last, baby! You know it. I've never seen a driver who wants to win more than this guy. I can get used to this winning thing! Really happy with that, and aside from that, these things look so badass. I can't wait to mount these up on the bike. They look so good, so I'm gonna go ahead and get them mounted on the bike right now, and yeah, we'll go ahead and get some shots of that. Damn, does the bike look wicked now. 
That is so crazy. Just all the carbon fiber, it's like, I mean, it's breathtaking. I know that sounds kind of cheesy, but it is what it is. Look at this. Look at the back end on this thing now. This is just crazy how the carbon fiber is popping. Like, I'm at a loss for words. It's like so hard to describe what this looks like in person and the quality that goes into these bags from Hoffman Designs is like insane. I mean, this is just, look, with the, with the tail section, the rear fender, excuse me, and then the bags, it's just, man, this thing looks crazy. It looks absolutely insane. Really? Nothing. And if y'all at Hoffman Designs are watching this video, I want y'all to know y'all are killing it with this carbon fiber game. I mean, you just, you guys are absolutely taking it to a complete another level. This is like exotic car stuff. This is what you're gonna see on, I mean, I'm sure y'all know about this, but this is what you see on like Ferraris, Porsches, Lamborghinis, but like the real, real, real nice ones, not even the basic stuff like the Lamborghini SVs. This is the kind of carbon you see on them. <laughs> I mean, it just looks sick. I can't wait to get in my side covers and there's a bunch of other stuff gonna go on. I can't let you guys know just yet, but you guys gotta stay tuned for that. So make sure to click that subscribe button. This way you can stay up to date with all the content on this build series. Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and chalk this up to a success. I hope you guys have found this video informative and I hope y'all have enjoyed all this carbon fiber goodies. I can't wait to get the bike out on the road to check this out. Make sure, once again, if you haven't clicked that subscribe button, you subscribe to my YouTube channel now. This way you can stay up to date with all of my content. I'd really appreciate it. And remember, it's also putting out good energy out there into the world. Also, don't forget anything that you are going to see in my videos is always gonna have links in the description box below where you can purchase these items from. And make sure if you call them up, you let them know that Michael Bertini from YouTube sent you and they'll go ahead and take care of you. Make sure y'all are putting good energy out there into the world and you're paying it forward. I'll check y'all out later. Bye now. I'll get you guys a little bit of a pull right now.